Hello, Leos. This is your mid-month for the 15th through the 31st. Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you're new, welcome to the channel, guys. Thank you for being here. Come and check me out. I do personal readings, and my web address is down below the video. Okay, guys? We're going to start with a Celtic cross here. This is the energy that is around you right now. The lovers was challenging you is the four of cups okay let's see the root of the issue why you're here what is the issue here is the queen of swords hmm let's see what was going on in the recent past huh the king of pentacles and what is the best possible outcome for my leos here the Eight of Wands. Hmm. Okay. And what's coming towards you guys is the Two of Pentacles. How you see yourself. The Knight of Cups. Your outside influence. It's the Four of Swords your hopes it's the emperor your fears hmm it's the king of cups hmm and the overall outcome is the king of wands here so the energy that's around you currently is having to choose between either yourself and someone else or choose between two people here okay um, but the fact of the matter is there is somebody that you are thinking about currently somebody that you feel you have a very strong connection with here okay could be a Gemini that you're dealing with it does not have to be um, but you know this is the energy that is currently affecting you okay your challenge is to decide whether or not you want to be with this person that you do love this person enough to to involve yourself with them or decide who it is that you want okay if you're not choosing between yourself and someone else, if it is indeed two people or even three people that um, you are, you know, having in your mind, then this is what your challenge is to decide what you want and be an active participant. Because this is like being complacent with the situation that you're currently in, okay? So let's see how you're actually viewing yourself. Okay, because, you know, the energy that's around you is you having to decide between yourself and love your, or two different lovers or three different lovers or however many people are involved in your life. So how you're seeing yourself currently is the, the Knight of Cups. Now, for me, this is you being charming. This is you um, possibly getting what you want when you want it. When you set your mind to it, this is you. I mean, I don't think you're in love with love. I just feel like if you want somebody, you feel like you can get them. Or you feel like that you know how to get them. You know what to do. Okay? The Knight of Cups. Cancer, um, Scorpio, Pisces energy there. Now, the issue here is <laughs> that somebody may be a little defensive. Somebody may feel like um, I'm not allowing you in because I'm good with myself. This is somebody that's very vocal, very um, true to her word, true to her nature. Um, she or he, okay? The gender is not specific here, but that is what this queen embodies. She embodies truth, um, standing in her own um like standing in her own her her being you know she's not wavering whatever she says is what she means and if she needs to cut out someone that's exactly what she does so maybe there is indeed a Gemini or other air sign 
that is significant in your reading here okay Gemini Libra Aquarius energy now what you guys were going through in the past what you were dealing with was um, the King of Pentacles you know deciding whether or not to really be there for someone deciding whether or not that you wanted to um, be a support system for someone or if somebody was going to be a support system for you maybe there was a little you know too much um, stagnant energy here maybe it was not um, exciting enough for you okay but this is what was going on this is a very stable energy um, comfortable in the situation comfortable within yourself not really wanting you know much change here okay now the best possible outcome hmm I feel like um, communication activity excitement um, traveling to someone traveling period going on vacations with this person or going on vacation by yourself because here again um, we have a choice to make okay now this can either be by yourself or this can be with someone else here okay could be two people that you're dealing with even maybe there's a bisexual um, connection here where some of you actually like both genders could be two people that you have to choose from male and female okay now what's coming in for you is just that there is a choice that you have to make here okay there is you know this is a two of Pentacles here so this is being sure of what it is that you want and I think that you are coming to a point where you will make a choice one way or the other you will gain balance in your life you can have yourself and have your freedom to be who you are and be with someone else at the same time okay be it that this is Pentacles I feel like you know you guys are you know moving or choosing between you know yourself and actually being there for somebody as a king of Pentacles here okay but I do think that you will make this choice in the very near future all right so your outside influence is that you know the reason why I think that you are having to make a choice right now is because there is someone and I feel this is air that has removed themselves from the equation okay maybe there was a three-party relationship situationship what have you and um, it was very hurtful so somebody decided to remove themselves here and I feel like you guys have not been speaking, you haven't been talking to each other, not communicating whatsoever. And I think it's kind of um, holding your feet to the fire in a sense where, you know, you have to either choose them or, you know, walk away from them. And it's like, it's, it's probably making you a little antsy right now. Both of you are coming with this very stable energy. So neither one of you is actually budging but your challenge here is to get out of your comfort zone okay it's not the other person's challenge your challenge is to get out of your comfort zone um, decide what it is that you want be sure of what it is that you want to do and how you want to do it okay so but your hopes are that you do not have to budge that you can have it your way that you know whatever is for you will come to you that is what your hopes are okay the Emperor does not move people come to him or her um, and I think that's where you are standing firm right now your fears is the King of Cups and I think you're just not you're not that comfortable with displaying emotion and I think you don't want to overreact. You also do not want um, you don't want to you know seem overly emotional here. 
I think you want to be emotionally stable. And that is your fear is not being emotionally stable when it comes to making this decision here. Okay? But in the overall outcome, we have the King of Wands. I think you will embark on a journey towards um, this person because kings are stable energy. They are very grounded. Kings are generally people who want to commit. Okay? So I think you will make a choice one way or the other to commit to um, someone here. Okay, but of course, you know, whoever it is, only you know, could be a fire sign energy here as well. Um, could be somebody that has has air in their chart or fire in their chart, however you want to look at it. But I do think that you will decide that um, commitment is probably, you know, where this is leading. Okay, so my Leo friends, that's what I have for you guys for mid-month and I'll speak with you soon.